Yo, what's good everybody? Hector here, back again with another video for you guys. I would like to welcome everyone back to the channel, but if you're new to the channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that bell icon so you're notified when I will drop new content to the channel. So now that that's out the way, today we're going to be doing a little bit of a different review. We're not going to be doing no retro. We're not going to be doing a Yeezy. Today we're going to be doing an Air Jordan 35 because they do have the 34s and the 35s. Uh, normally I don't usually purchase those so um, this is actually gonna be wifey's pair again so she's gonna you know she let me review her pair now these did retail for hundred and forty dollars but it's because it's a grade school size um, I think the men's size was like a buck eighty so hundred and eighty dollars retail for the men's and then the grade school sizes are a hundred and forty now right off the rip like the box the box is pretty cool I always like these boxes like the the 30 the 34s they had a cool box too. These are the zoos. Like they had a, they, this, this box is dope, all right? Like this is cool as hell. But we're not doing that, we're doing the 35s. Now, this is a size five youth and the colors are black, fire red, reflect, silver, neor, Ar argan, Ro what, huh? You stupid. But anyway, getting right down to it, this is like the, you know, the bread colorway this is a really cool sneaker i feel like it's way way underrated super slept on not a lot of people like it this is a dope sneaker so without further ado let's let's get right into it because i want to show you how to box so the box the box is tight fire the way the box opens so you lift the flap put this on oh, i might have to do it this way but this side opens like this and the other side opens like that i think that's pretty dope like that, that's that's some cool stuff right there but anyway let's open up the sneaker you already know we're gonna box it together as usual check that bad boy out that's a pretty sneaker i'm not i'm not trying to hear nothing else this sneaker is fire boom so there we have it the Air jordan 35 in the bread colorway this 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 look look at that hold on we're gonna we're gonna get to that hold on i'm getting, I'm getting too ahead of myself all right so initial thoughts this sneaker is different all right this is a 35 and it, it, it's different like i said it's different but it's so cool i like it like the like it, it's dope so first thing we're gonna get into we're gonna get into the outside of the sneaker first thing i'd like the, the, the most notable thing is this holographic like plastic piece right there and it's really really nice it's shiny as hell it kind of reminds me of my old galaxy the the backing was just like this it was it was amazing next here on the upper you have like this like netting material but the the, the strings or the laces whatever you want to call them it's like you know black with like red spots on it it gives it a, it gives it a nice touch i like it we got some uh i, I don't know if it, i wouldn't even call it suede material on this end but it's really soft it runs up to the front and back here to the heel um it like i said it's nice it's soft I, I i don't think it's actual uh suede but we're just gonna call it suede for now coming up to the midsole you have the white midsole with the black paint splatters honestly i think this shoe would look so bland if it didn't have these paint splatters i think it would look nice don't get me wrong but I feel like the, the, the paint splatters gives it that extra pop. You know what I mean? Also here, running through the middle of the midsole, we have this, this plastic piece right here that runs through and inside the, the, the sneaker, you know, all the way to the other side. But um, yeah, so it starts off black. It runs down to the lower part of the midsole, uh, transitioning to red. And then right here, it has like some braille writings. I don't know how to read it. So I, I don't know what it says. If you guys know what it says, please drop it down in the comments below. Moving on to the front of the sneaker here on the toe, you have like some more like netting material runs up all through the tongue. We got the red and black laces, which I, I actually like the laces. They're, they're, they're cool. They, they pretty much match with the siding right here. Like not, not, you know, super closely, but they, they do match. I also forgot the tongue. I also forgot the tongue. The tongue is reflective. It's pretty dope. It, it, it literally, you know, the same tongue as you would see like on, on the Jordan 5 or something like that. Minus, you know, this little pull tab right here. But yeah, it still, it looks pretty nice. I'm not even gonna hold you. Like it really looks nice. Coming up to the inside of the sneaker, you have the same white midsole with the paint splatters, same plastic piece. But, you know, it's a little bit smaller on this end. You got the black transitioning into the red. And you have that same material uh, from the other side. The netting here and the holographic 
tab right here which i i really like that a lot like i, I think that's like my favorite part of the thing i don't know why but this is just dope all right moving to the heel got the back little little plat little uh tab right there got the jordan Jumpman logo nike air over here uh, and that's pretty much it self-explanatory moving to the bottom of the sneaker you have an all red outsole black jump man logo uh right there it says air zoom also in that nice holographic color whatever you want to call it, it, it yeah I'm, I'm i'm like really fiend out for this color but yeah all red uh you know all red outsole um i feel like these will have really really good traction and they should being that this is I feel like it's a, a performance model, not more, you know, not a lifestyle model where you're just gonna rock it here and there. Like, this is more like you about to ball up on the court and, uh, you know, you need some good traction. You probably throw these on. Coming to the inside, you got black sock liner, black insole with the red Jumpman logo. You know, nothing too special in there. But on the back of the tongue right here, you got the 35. You got three X's, which is 30. And then the, you know, they did the V, which is a five. Kind of just together so it looks dope i like it nice touch goes pretty good with the with the red so yeah that was a, that was pretty much all the ins and outs um a little bit about the sneaker the the heel it's it's really stiff it's very very stiff um i'm pretty sure that that's so you can have you know angle support when you're on the court or whatever but yo this is a stiff stiff sock liner like holy crap so wifey did recommend going a half size up um these fit pretty tight so like half size up she's a five i think with a five and a half she should be straight now like i said in the beginning of the video these are very very slept on i feel like these are very underrated and i feel like if people were to warm up to them i feel like they do amazing these don't even look that bad compared to a lot of the stuff that's out there now these don't look bad and then the reflective tongue like gives it just bonus points like i'm digging a reflective tongue but you know that's just my opinion you guys can let me know y'all opinion down in the comments below also let me know did you go for these and if you did do you do you like them like do you like the way they fit do you like the way they look i honestly she tried the uh wifey tried them on yesterday and i thought they looked really nice like way better than i expected but yeah that's pretty much all the time i have for this review if you guys did enjoy this video and did make it this far please go ahead and drop a like on this video because a like goes a long way and it helps the channel out also if you're not already subscribed to the channel what are you waiting for hit that subscribe button and that bell icon so you're notified whenever i drop new content to the channel also also i am now on twitch if you want to give me a follow here's my twitch account go ahead and give me a follow Follow. also if you want to give wifey a follow she also has a twist go ahead and give her a follow we recently made affiliate so that's a pretty dope you know thing going on um we're trying to get partnered and eventually just keep doing the gaming thing full time so you know i'll be doing sneaker videos and i'll be doing twitch so who knows maybe i'll transition more to one and to other but i you know I'll, I'll keep you guys updated you know i'm gonna still be doing the sneaker thing here and there but um yeah definitely give us a follow but anyway i want to thank you guys again for watching thank you guys so much i appreciate all you know all the support that that y'all be you know the comments the likes and all that stuff definitely appreciate it a lot more than y'all think but yeah one more time thank you guys again for watching until next time